Okay, um, hello guys. I'm gonna do a review on this this custom Lego family home. And there's a lot of detailing on the house. And it's got two roofs and a chimney with a cover over it. And we're gonna take a look at the front yard. And there's nothing in the backyard. But let's take a look at the front yard. So, this is something new to my house. There's a bird on the roof. There's a porch and there's some white banister bricks. So it's banister bricks. And this house is just massive. It's a five bedroom, two bathroom. Well, actually it has three bathrooms. It's five bedroom, three bathrooms. And this is one of my biggest little houses I've ever built. And there's some flowers here and some plants, mailbox, and there's actually a letter inside it. See? There's the mailbox. Or the post box. And there's a vehicle here. Red vehicle. And a bike. And a little green tree. There's some flowers and brown banister bricks in the porch. Backyard. There's nothing in the backyard, like I said. See, here's the backyard. And there's just a plant here in the back door with some with some silver paving slabs. Now let's see who this is going to Back door. So now we're going to take a look at the inside. And the inside is fully furnished. So here's the inside. So here's the first story. So basically when you walk in, there's a front door and there's a light fixture. When, basically when you walk in, and the first part is the hallway, and there's a hat rack. There's a hat rack there. And Okay, so here's the daughter. Here's the daughter. And she's got purple pants and purple and a purple shirt. And she's going upstairs. There's no banister bricks on the staircase, but and here's the living room. There's a this is the full living room. There's a fireplace with fire in it. And the, the, and the main thing that I like about this is there's one by two gray paving slabs. And I like them because they kind of look like brick, like stone. And there's a couch, table, and a lamp. And and you come in the archway here. This is the kitchen. So this kitchen is, well, here's the kitchen. So there's a tap or sink, and a cake, chicken leg, croissants. There's a mom reading a cookbook. And there's the silver frying pan. And so there's the kitchen, and there's the window facing out to the front yard. Um, 
So yeah, there's the kitchen, and there's that fridge. That fridge that I just stacked two cabinets on top of each other. And if you come in your way here, and there's a dining room. And there's a doorbell for the front door. And coming door here, there's a laundry room. I mean, no, this isn't the laundry room. This is the bathroom. And there's a bottle of soap, sink, and a toilet. And coming the archway here, here's the din. And there's a flat screen, sofa, coffee table, toy box. This is part of the playroom. And then you come in the door here, the black door, this one, come in there, there is a laundry room, there's a broom, and a washer. So yeah, that's the laundry room. And there's another door, that goes into the workshop. There's, there's the dad. And there's a wrench, there's a drill, that's the only two tools I have, so, so yep, that's basically the first storm. Now we'll just stick the second storm. So here's the second story. So basically when you walk up the stairs, you're going to see those nice banister bricks. And if you come in the door here, you got the master bedroom. There's some clothes there, clothing, bed. And there's the hole that goes all the way down to the fireplace. And there's a dresser. And there's actually a light switch. And I forgot to, so to show you the light switch down in the laundry room on the first story. And, but we can't go back down to the first story. So it's too late right now. But, but yeah, that's the master bedroom. And there's a door. And I want this master bedroom to have a walk-in closet, but I didn't have enough room. And I, if I put it here, then it would be blocking the, the smoke from coming out of the chimney, the fireplace. So, but I put a shelf where he puts his favorite things. And... And there's the door that goes into the master bathroom. So there's a sink, a really nice sink, and a toilet. That toilet looks really nice because I use a 2x2 two two round brick on the bottom. And there's a 1x1 one one round plate there for, well, I'm... I just made, put that there to make it look good. So yeah, and there's a glass door, and this is my first ever house to have a shower. So this shower is really nice because I got that tap there. I got that tap there and the glass door. And, but I ran out of tiles to put on the floor. So these, so I just left the studs in here, but it looks really good. So, when you come back in the hallway, and here's the minor bedroom. And here's the minor bedroom. It's seven studs wide. And there's a window there. This is out to the backyard. And... There's a floor mat, floor mat, and bed, two by three nightstand, and some clothes, just like in the master bedroom. 
Okay, and here is the Dar's bedroom. There's the computer set and bed, black one, and a cup of on a nightstand. And here is the child's bedroom. So that's the fourth bedroom. And this house is massive because it has five bedrooms, two bathrooms. So, and then when you come, when you come in this door here, you'll see another kid's bedroom. And I was running out of room in here, but it looks good. So, there's a fish tank. There's some seaweed inside the fish tank. And radio. Surfboard. And lamp on the nightstand. And a dark green bed. There's a fish tank. And you might think, think that the fish tank is a TV, but it really isn't. It's fish tank. There's a skateboard. So yeah, that's basically the second story. Thank you for watching.